Traveling to the Amazon is something you can do considering your budget and your travel style. Important fact, actually 60% of Peru is covered by tropical rainforest. Located in the map, these destinations will be Iquitos, Tambopata and Man. There are also different ways that you can explore the Amazonian rainforest that will match with your travel style. First, you will have the hotels in the city. When you stay in a hotel in the city, in the nearby city, that means that you will have to cover the lodging, the accommodation, the meals, and also the excursions that you are going to take. Then you have the ecologists. Most of the ecologists are going to be all-inclusive. That means that they are going to cover transportation, meals, activities, and accommodation. Then you will have the cruises. The cruises are going to cover more or less the same as the ecologists. That means that you will have an all-inclusive experience. Now let's talk about the destinations. In Iquitos, you are going to find the amazing Amazon River. And the Amazon River includes the possibilities to see dolphins, pink river dolphins, and also manatees. Here, you are going to be able to find three ways to visit this destination. Hotels, ecologists, and cruises. In Iquitos, you are going to find a wide diversity of hotels, different kinds, three stars, four stars, even five stars. Most of the hotels in Iquitos are going to have air conditioning, swimming pool, and all the hotel services that you can find everywhere. A quick note, remember that by staying in an eco lodge, that means that you are not going to have perhaps air conditioning or swimming pools, but you are going to have more opportunities to see wildlife. During the cruise, most of the activities are going to be self-adventure excursions that everyone can do. Now let's talk about Tambopata. Tambopata is located southeast of Peru, just next to Cusco. This is in the Madre de Dios department, well known as the capital of the biodiversity. In Tambopata, you don't need to go too far to start watching wildlife. Nevertheless, remember that, of course, if you go farther, you are going to have more opportunities to spot wildlife. You can explore Tambopata by staying in a hotel in the city of Puerto Maldonado. There, you will find three and four star hotels. From there, you can take half day or full day tours to different places in the area. A quick note, in Tambopata, we have two main rivers, the Madre de Dios River and the Tambopata River. In the Madre de Dios River are located most of the accessible eco lodges. Also, is the gate to visit Sandoval Lake. The Tambopata River, in the other hand, is going to cross in the middle of the Tambopata National Reserve and it's going to the Baguaja Sonene National Park too. By staying in an eco lodge in the Tambopata River, you are going to have great chances to see wildlife. Quick tip, there are just a couple of lodges that are inside in the Tambopata National Reserve. Also, the Tambopata River is going to have the most amazing natural spectaculars, the Colpas de Guacamayos or Macocle Lakes. Finally, we have Man. In Manu, you are going to be able to visit cloud forest and rainforest. To get to Manu National Park, you have to stay at least one night in Cusco because the expeditions start very early in the morning. To get into the Manu National Park, we highly recommend at least four nights. And this is because of the accessibility. The expedition will take you from the city of Cusco, then to the cloud forest, and finally to the rainforest. Check out our resources in the description below to get more information about prices and where to stay.